So this is what's on my ZTE Z Max Pro. As you can see for the lock screen, I did customize this in settings. I did put Paltech ZTE Z Max Pro. I got this really cool widget, which you can use in the lock screen and in the home screen, which I'll go into more further detail. The fingerprint sensor as my secure way of unlocking this device. I got the Google search bar up on top and I got this really cool widget which tells me the date on my Z Max Pro here. Go ahead and click on that here. This is the Zuper widget, so you can actually customize the layout, the widget background, uh, widget on tap, um, action, location. There's so much you can do in the settings of this widget here. I highly recommend it. Now there is two versions of this. There is a free one and then there's one that you have to pay for but you can fully customize this to your liking. As we move on, I do got the ZTE Z Max Pro application on my device, really good group. If you do own a Z Max Pro, highly recommend uh, joining this group on Facebook. As we move on, I do got camera, Play Store, and of course my Google folder here for Google Chrome, Maps, YouTube Drive, etc. Now, as we go ahead and move on, I'm gonna show you this floating toolbar widget here. Now this is completely free off the Google Play Store. I highly recommend this. This gives you perfect access to one-handed operation. You can customize which applications you want. For instance, YouTube, your calendar. You can also customize this to jump to, for instance, Amazon. This is great for one-handed operation. You can move it around to your liking on whatever part of the screen you'd like and it just makes one-handed operation just perfect. As you can see, I jumped to Google Plus there. So I highly recommend picking up that application. Now, as we move on, this is my message application. You can customize this on the ZTE Z Max Pro in the settings of your keyboard. As you can see, that's my background image and that's my keyboard, fully customizable on the Z Max Pro. As we move on, I also have this separate Zuper widget which I've customized for a quote of the day. As you can see there, I got my, and I also have my subscriber count widget, Messenger, Amazon, and Twitter. You can follow me on Twitter as well. We also have Pixlr. Pixlr is, has to be one of my favorite applications for uh, making collages, editing your photos. I'll give you some examples here of ways you can edit a photo. There's so many options here. I mean, there's just so much variety to choose from. You can really customize and be very creative with any type of photo you do take. And again, this is completely free off the Google Play Store. And there's just so many different options on customizing your photos. Another app that I definitely recommend on your Z Max Pro. As we move on, we'll go on to that floating toolbar. This is the settings here. So you can really customize this to your liking. You can change the color of it. You can change the size of the floating toolbar. Highly recommend this with a six inch display. This is gonna give you good one-handed operation with it. Now to customize and get that Metro PCS message that's on the top corner, you can use this app right here. As you can see, I put best phone 2016, which I actually typed best $99 phone of 2016. Now one of my favorite games is Geometry Dash. Really enjoy this game. I like it a lot. I play this with my kids and we compete against each other. Uh, really awesome game and I've always enjoyed this and I download this on actually every device, uh, practically every device that I do own and uh, it's just really cool game and there's different uh, versions of this on the Google Play Store and uh, this is just one that I do have. So as you can see here, this is what's on my ZTE Z Max Pro. Uh, those are the majority of the apps that I have downloaded that I use the most on my Z Max Pro. So hopefully you enjoy this. Hopefully you can use some of these applications on your Z Max Pro. I definitely recommend all of them. They will all work really well. They're all completely free on the Google Play Store. This is Paul Tech and I'll talk to you on the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye.